We're here at the Loves gas station in Vianne right off of I-40. Now this is where the Sequoia County Sheriff says Lee King was last seen before he allegedly shot two people who had picked King up as a hitchhiker. These are photos of surveillance video captured at the Loves gas station that show King right before police say he shot two good Samaritans that had picked him up as a hitchhiker. The Sequoia County Sheriff says King shot and carjacked a woman in Oklahoma City before heading to Vianne. He says King ran out of gas on I-40 and two good Samaritans picked him up and took him to the Loves so he could get more gas. The two men drove King back to his stolen car with gas in a gas can. The Oklahoma State Bureau of Investigation says that's when King allegedly shot the two men who were found laying near the road at mile marker 293. People who live in and around Vianne say it's terrifying that something like this happened in the community. I just thought it was scary because it was so close to home and like I said I have family down here. It teaches me you know that I have to be more careful and not just you know go out everywhere and you know always be prepared for the worst I guess. We live in this small town and if somebody happens to somebody in this town then we're gonna know them no matter who it is. So um you know I hope he's left this town but I don't want him to be anywhere. anywhere. I just want him to be found. At around 4.30 this morning, officers in Antlers, Oklahoma, spotted King's car and King led them on a chase. He ran away from police and they say they started searching for King somewhere in Texas. The sheriff says both of the shooting victims are in critical condition. People in Vianne say they're thinking of the victims' families. My prayers and all my heart, my thought goes out to all of y'all. And I just want y'all to know how the whole community is worried about y'all and we all care and we will all keep prayers going and keep looking. You know, we hope that you get some peace and comfort. The Sequoia County Sheriff says both of the victims are from Greenwood, Arkansas. He says one of them was flown to Little Rock for facial reconstruction surgery. The other victim also underwent surgery this morning. The OSBI is helping the Sequoia County Sheriff's Office with the investigation. In Vianne, Emma Claybrook, 4029 News.